ultralight flying offers one of the quickest and purest ways to experience the joys of aviation. Whether you're into powered parachutes, trikes, traditional fixed wings, or even amphibians and rotorcraft, ultralights offer loads of fun and excitement. And the best part? They're usually quite affordable and don't require a license to fly. Unlike standard aircraft, ultralight aircraft are not subject to stringent FAA regulations, making them the least regulated and simplest to operate without a license. Back in 1982, the FAA introduced something called Part 103. It's a simple set of rules that applies to ultralight vehicles. With Part 103, you don't need to bother with FAA registration, any sort of pilot certificate, or even an aviation medical, and you can either buy one that's ready to fly or build it yourself using kits as long as you follow the AC-103-7 guidelines. However, to qualify for Part 103, the aircraft must be a single-seater weighing less than 254 pounds and used solely for recreational or sports flying. Surprisingly, some aircraft weigh more than 254 pounds but are still considered ultralights. So be sure to hit that like and subscribe button as we explore the most surprisingly cool planes you can fly without a license. Eswan 120. If you desire to pilot a fully enclosed aircraft, this elegant ultralight airplane is your ideal solution. The Swan 120 is developed by the AVI aircraft engineering team in Romania to meet a wide range of customer needs. This single-seat ultralight airplane complies with FAR Part 103 in the USA and LTFL in Germany. In the US market, it is known as the Swan 103, while in Europe, it is referred to as the Swan 120 SW and comes equipped with a recovery parachute. The airframe is made from vacuum-formed and thermally treated carbon fiber, or glass fiber, with epoxy resin. This aircraft has an empty weight of 244 pounds, a length of 17 feet, and a wingspan of 22 feet. The versatility of this ultralight aircraft shines through its ability to be easily folded in various dimensions from length to width and height, making transportation and parking hassle-free. Powered by a Polini Thor 303 engine generating 38 horsepower, it can cruise at speeds of 62 miles per hour and has a range of 200 miles. The base price of the Swan is approximately €31,000 or $33,000, and for those opting for added features such as a rescue system, radio equipment, and a trailer serving as a mobile hangar. The complete package is priced at €39,955 or $43,000. Exiel Mosquito if you're looking to venture into the world of ultralight aviation with the added capability of vertical takeoff, the XEL Mosquito helicopter is an excellent choice. Developed by Composite FX, this ultralight helicopter meets the requirements of an ultralight aircraft under Part 103 of the FAA regulations in the United States, despite its weight of 312 pounds. It's important to note a loophole in United States federal aviation regulations. Part 103 mandates a maximum weight of 254 pounds, with an additional 60 pounds allowance for a flotation device, bringing the total allowance to 314 pounds, thereby giving the XEL Mosquito a two-pound margin. However, in order for this helicopter to be considered Part 103 compliant, floats must be installed. It features a single main rotor and tail rotor, a single seat enclosed cockpit with a windshield, and a fuselage constructed from composites and metal tubing. Powered by the MZ202 engine, it cruises at a speed of 62 miles per hour and can remain airborne for over 45 minutes with its five gallon fuel tank. This ultralight helicopter is one of the most affordable and modern options available on the market, with a price tag of $54,000 for the kit version, which you can assemble at home. Alternatively, you can opt for a factory-finished model at $69,000. Aventura UL 
If you're searching for a method to achieve water and land landings without requiring a license, then Aero Adventure of Florida offers the perfect solution with their ultralight amphibian aircraft marketed as a kit aircraft. This remarkable aircraft not only allows for water and land landings, but also on various surfaces such as sand, grass, snow or pavement, making it ideal for all your flying adventures. And that's not all. This aircraft excels in short takeoff and landing performance, even when operating off the water. It can take off and land in under 320 feet, a feat that many other aircraft cannot accomplish when landing on water or a runway. This gives you the freedom to safely take off and land in almost any location. This aircraft's wing features an aluminum frame covered with pre-sewn Dacron envelopes, while the hull is made of fiberglass and the wingtip floats are constructed from polyethylene. The rest of the structure consists of anodized aluminum tubing bolted together. With the inclusion of floats, the aircraft weighs 314 pounds, making it compliant with the FAR Part 103 regulation, thanks to the loophole allowing for the addition of 61 pounds for the floats. It is equipped with a Rotax 277 engine, achieving a cruising speed of 62 miles per hour and a range of approximately 250 miles. This aircraft can be purchased on the market for approximately $30,000 to $32,500, offering an exciting and versatile flying experience without the need for a pilot's license. Myrocopter SCH-2A Manufactured in Slovenia, the SCH-2 A small coaxial helicopter is one of the lightest manned coaxial helicopters in the world, fully compliant with US FAR Part 103 ultralight vehicle regulations due to its light weight of just 249 pounds. This helicopter, which has undergone over a decade of development and testing, is known for its exceptional flight characteristics, including effective autorotation. With proper care, the SCH-2A offers a reliable and enjoyable flight experience at very low operational and maintenance costs. It functions as a true helicopter, allowing for standard helicopter command inputs, while also qualifying as an ultralight aircraft that can be flown without a license. Vertical thrust is achieved through the collective blade pitch control of both rotors, while cyclic blade pitch control provides directional control and yaw control is managed by moving tailplates, eliminating the need for a tail rotor, resulting in increased lifting capacity and the ability to operate in smaller spaces. Equipped with a Fiat MZ202 engine generating 60 horsepower, this open cockpit helicopter can reach a top speed of 62 miles per hour and has a cruising time of approximately one hour thanks to its five-gallon fuel tank. Afford a plane. For over 20 years, the Affordaplane Sport aircraft has been enabling people to achieve their dreams of flight safely and affordably. Commonly known as the A-Plane, this single-seat, all-aluminum aircraft that can be built either as a FAR 103 legal ultralight or a light sport aircraft, giving builders the flexibility to choose their preferred configuration. When constructed as an ultralight, the A-plane weighs 254 pounds and cruises at a speed of 55 miles per hour with a range of 150 miles. For the Part 103 ultralight version, it is designed to be powered by a 35 GP Rotax 377 or a similar engine. While it is possible to use heavier and more powerful engines such as the Rotax 503, Doing so would exceed the weight limit of 254 pounds imposed by FAR Part 103. The A-plane's construction plans are designed to enable both beginners and experts to construct their own airplanes using common hand tools. It offers excellent performance and is easy to fly, boasting a flawless safety record. As a result, numerous individuals from around the world have taken to the skies in their very own Afforda planes. Blackhawk Lowboy 3. If you happen to be a fan of powered paragliding, then the Blackhawk Lowboy III, weighing 190 pounds, may just be the ideal ultralight aircraft for you. 
This particular powered paraglider has incorporated 6,061 large diameter aluminum tubing, which not only makes the platform lighter, but also ensures its durability remains intact. Additionally, it now comes equipped with Tundra-style tires as a standard feature, along with thicker fiberglass axles for enhanced strength. The platform is designed with quick-release pins throughout, making it much easier to collapse or fold for convenient transportation. Blackhawk has also introduced a new multi-positional hang point system, allowing pilots to swiftly and precisely adjust the paramotor's center of gravity. Remarkably, skilled pilots can take off with just 50 to 75 feet of runway and land in as little as 25 feet. This exceptional performance allows many pilots to use their own backyard as a flight field, eliminating the need for a traditional runway. Kolb Firefly The Kolb Firefly is an American-made ultralight aircraft featuring an open cockpit, single-seat, high-wing, pusher configuration, and conventional landing gear. Produced in kit form by New Kolb Aircraft of London, Kentucky, it is intended for amateur construction. Designed in 1995, the Firefly is an evolution of the Kolb Firestar and complies with the American Part 103 ultralight regulations of a maximum empty weight of 254 pounds. To achieve this weight limit, the Firefly features a forward fuselage made of welded 4,130 steel tubing, which is connected to an aluminum tail boom. The horizontal stabilizer, tail fin and wings are also constructed using riveted aluminum tubing and all flying surfaces are covered in doped aircraft fabric. Additionally, the wings are designed to fold quickly for storage and ground transport. Powering the Kolb Firefly is the Rotax 447 engine, which has a higher horsepower rating of 40 horsepower, allowing the aircraft to reach a cruise speed of 60 miles per hour. Merlin Light. Most ultralights are ideal for fair weather local flying, but not for cross country trips due to their airspace restrictions and cruise speeds. However, the Merlin Light changes much of this. Designed as a fully enclosed ultralight aircraft, it features a 4.15 gallon wing tank, allowing for approximately four hours of flight at a speed of 63 miles per hour offering a range of more than 260 miles, thus providing many pilots. The opportunity to take off and enjoy a dawn patrol or evening sorties than ever before. Although its weight of 271 pounds exceeds the recommended 254 pounds, it can still be flown as a Part 103 ultralight with virtually no regulations, provided a BRS rescue system is installed to increase the allowable weight to 278 pounds. It is a joy to fly, capable of taking off and landing in under 150 feet. Priced at $31,000, it offers a fun and accessible flying experience. Fokker D8 Ultralight. It is a lightweight replica of the 1918 Fokker, produced by Airdrome Aeroplanes and available as either a kit or a ready-to-fly aircraft. With its sleek monoplane design, the Fokker emerged as one of the top fighters during World War I. It possessed exceptional performance capabilities and had the potential to alter the course of the war. But unfortunately, it was not manufactured until the war's conclusion, rendering its impact negligible. Nowadays, you have the opportunity to own your very own Fokker D8. Airdrome Aeroplanes offers two versions of this remarkable aircraft, an ultralight model and an experimental version. The ultralight variant features a smaller engine, the Rotax 377 generating 35 horsepower, while the experimental version boasts the Rotax 503 generating 52 horsepower, providing slightly greater speed. The airframe of the ultralight version is constructed using modern materials like aluminum and rivets, weighing in at 253 pounds with a cruising speed of 63 miles per hour. A comprehensive kit from Airdrome Aeroplanes, ready for your final color coat, is available for around $6,000. Breezer B-400 The Breezer is a low-wing, single-engine ultralight aircraft that seats two side-by-side. 
Designed and built in Germany, it meets European ultralight requirements, and in the US, it qualifies as a light sport aircraft. In production since 2001, the Breezer embodies dynamism and the joy of flying while offering maximum safety through high-quality German craftsmanship. It's no surprise that the Breezer is one of the best-selling low-wing aircraft in Germany. Whether used as a club and training aircraft or as a sporty touring plane, the Breezer delights pilots daily. Its forgiving flight characteristics instill confidence in inexperienced pilots, while experienced pilots appreciate its reliability and safety for sporting trips and quick flights. Snake Trike The Eurofly Snake is an ultra-compact trike, combining a hang glider wing with a suspended trike underneath. These nanolights have been in existence for many years but are now classified as a new type of aircraft in the UK that does not require a pilot's license. The Snake Trike is a revolutionary minimalistic trike that is lightweight, practical, cost-effective and accessible to all. It adheres to stringent safety standards, featuring an upper mast made from a double 6082-6 alloy tube with an external diameter of 47 by 1.25, as well as a lower mast made from double tube construction. Safety is of utmost importance, which is why the Snake Trike is equipped with a nose wheel brake for essential safety measures and exceptional performance on short runways. Its solid main undercarriage legs are incredibly robust, eliminating the need for draggy bracing wires and providing effective suspension on rough ground. Aerolite 103 The AeroWorks Aerolite 103 is an American single-seat, high-wing, pusher configuration, ultralight aircraft designed by Terry Raber. Introduced by AeroWorks of Ohio in 1997, its model number signifies compliance with the FAA's Part 103 ultralight rules. Production ceased in 2005 when the manufacturer went out of business. However, the original designer repurchased the design rights, updated the aircraft with an aluminum fuel tank, and resumed production in 2013 through U-Fly-It Light Sport Aircraft.